everyone, and welcome to the new season of Blood Bowl. Promising to be legendary. Indeed, Bob. This new season certainly will be exceptional. Numerous new teams of all races are gathering right now from all across the old world to participate in this prestigious competition. I've heard that some of the new teams have offered the use of their newly refurbished stadiums. See, even the undead have cleaned up their favorite crypt for this season. All these new stadiums certainly won't go amiss if we have to welcome all these new teams. They're coming from all around the old world, from the cold Norse lands to the most arid deserts. Even the dead are on their way. Let's not forget to bring some flowers for the ladies. The Amazon teams have signed up for the competition. Appearances can be deceiving, Jim. These ladies are real furious, believe me. Even the proponents of fair play will be well treated. Mercenaries, high elves, and elves will be competing. So many new faces, this is for certain. The show will be exceptional. That's right, Bob. Then bring them on. Alive or dead, men or women, giants or halflings, all are welcome. As it is now time for the... Hello, viewer! Welcome to Blood Bowl Legendary Edition. I just bought this game because I was so bloody um, <laughs> excited about it. Because I watched Variax play it on his Saturday Let's Play, and it, it looks great. And it, uh, I played Warhammer Fantasy uh, a couple of years ago for a bit, and it was great fun. And I read about Blood Bowl and stuff. <laughs> And I, I always liked the concept and the humor in the game, so so yeah, it's it's so I bought the game and here we go. I just played the tutorial, so I know a bit of about the game because it, it, it's not really rule heavy, but you know, it has some rules that you should know before you play, maybe. So let's, but uh, I wanted to record it, but there was no music and uh, yeah, that that wasn't so great. So let's play. Exhibit match with a famous team or a custom made team with worrying war post game consequence. Not the post game sequence. Begin a campaign. Begin a competition. Uh, uh, I don't know. Should we play a campaign? Screw it, let's play a campaign viewer. But I will I will take I'll have to take care of it tiny bit of option stuff, like graphics and sound, so I'll be back in just a second. And here we are again. I'm done with the options. Playing in Blitz mode allows you to change rules or to, or to add ones. Change rules or to add ones. But we're not in the original Blood Bowl board, ga board game. You will be able to customize player equipment, negotiate contracts with players, and even play real-time matches. It's up to you to decide which features to use. Playing in classic mode means you'll play exactly in the same way as the Blood Bowl, Blood Bowl board game. It's a turn-based mode with the rules from the Blood Bowl competition rules. I have no idea. <laughs> Let's go with Blitz because he has color and he does not. Enter a campaign name here. Let's play. Um, medium, yeah. Turn-based, turn -based, yes. Yes, definitely better raised. Yeah, what race should we be? Let's women all or nothing. <laughs> Amazons. Or should we be Chaos? <clears throat> I don't really like Chaos that I like Dark Elves, however. <laughs> nice face. Right? Yeah. Friendly, 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 Dark Elves. Hmm, maybe. You beyond belief, skilled without doubt, the Dark Elves take the pitch to show the world their superior superiority. Huh. <laughs> dark Elf teams prefer a malevolent and... Male yeah, malevolent and spiteful rubbing game over the passing of the goodly cousins. Backed up by the ruthless witch elves and dangerous assassins, a dark elf team has all has all the tools to power through rather than around any opponent lines. Or precision lines, what am I even talking about? Um yeah, maybe, maybe. I like Warhammer Dwarfs. <laughs> they are epic. I mean look at that Mohawk. 
and, and, and all his all his crazy you know chains and uh, oh I thought it was it was a not a monocle but you know whatever you know never mind <laughs> I like him dwarves are ideal blood bowl players being compact though uh, tough. <laughs> Well armored and having a stubborn knack of refusing to die, most successful br dwarf teams work to the principle that if they can massacre all the other team's best players and wear down the rest, then there won't be anyone left to stop them scoring touchdown. Yeah, that's actually pretty nice. <laughs> Elves. What? Uh, see, see, this doesn't look anything like an elf. <laughs> Not does it? Relax, why should they be any different? <laughs> but I won't play else. Don't care. Goblins are pretty cool too. They play unfair, they have bombs and, and <laughs> all kinds of stuff. Ah, goblin teams. Uh, but I won't play as goblins though. Halflings, I don't even care. High elves, yeah, they look like, like elves, you know. Humans, but... Like a pack of wolves, we close in on our prey, on our prey even. Life was better in the good old days. <laughs> Camry or Camry. However you pronounce it correctly. So I remember they like uh they had skeletons and stuff. I'm not sure I I if it if they have skeletons in Blood Bowl, but I think they had skeletons and all kinds of undead, uh, they are like desert undead with mummies and all that stuff. Lizard man. Uh, maybe. Necromantic. Frankly, we might bite you. <laughs> the damned and the cursed do not always lurk in the forests or in the graveyards of the old world. Sometimes they come together, forming a group to hunt those, mo those more fortunate of souls. Finding relief in crazed outbursts of terrible violence, these groups do the best they can to ease their suffering. They pop off for a nice game of Blood Bowl. Maybe. Norse. No. <laughs> no! I just don't like Norse. Uh, Nurgle. Yeah, they're, they're actually pretty nice. Ogres. If at first we don't succeed, we try again. After that, eat coach. But there's still movement there, Spart. Orcs, yeah. Why should I kill? What? Skaven? What? What the? I've, yeah, Skaven are like Ratman. What the hell? Look at this guy. Awesome. They may not be all that strong, they certainly aren't tough, but boy oh boy are Skaven fast. Many an opponent has been left in the starting blobs as fast moving Skaven players scamper through a gap in the line and run in for lightning fast touchdown. I actually could like that. Ah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm dead. In the old world, the dead do not rest easy. Vamp vampires lurk in haunted in haunted castles. Necromancers seek to escape death by searching. <laughs> Whatever. Forbidden knowledge, the Lich Lord rules over a legion of corpses and on the Blood Bowl few players who died long ago return to the scene of the former glory and play Blood Bowl once again. Vampire. I like how they have different uh, undead teams. What else? <laughs> we'll go with Dark Elves, people. Because I love Dark Elves in, in in Warhammer Fantasy. Let's see. They have assassins and all kinds of crazy crap. <laughs> Hydras! Let's go with... Huh. Huh. What's this? No! No! Um, will it change her? Yeah! It actually does. We'll stay with this. Let's go with that. And the team name, oh god. I have to come up with something witty, but I won't. I won't! Dark girls don't even think about escape, yeah. Yeah. Why, why should you? <laughs> 
<sighs> a team name, eh? Dark Elves. I can't remember if they have any any symbol symbolics that I could use. Symbols, rather. You know, if they were like uh, Dungeons and Dragons Dark Elves, like Drow, I would do a pun about the Spider Queen or something. About Lolf. Lolf, Lolf, whatever. <laughs> um... Yeah. Yeah, that's what we'll go with. It's unoriginal, but hey, whatever. I just want to play the game. Begin a campaign. Past patient prowlers. Now, what do we do here? A charity competition. Whoa, whoa. The clean cup is much sought after the after but a smaller team so see there's a low cost rule to make a reputation for themselves. An additional benefit is come on. That the major sides tend to ignore the cup because of the strict rules that are enforced. Hmm. The winner gets plus ten prestige. And three ground? No. Thirty ground. Thirty ground, yes. The distant Albion. The purity. Let's. Maybe we can. Mark tools. Let's try this one. I don't. I don't. I don't know what what I'm doing here. So. Ranking. Let's see. Although yeah. We're, oh. <laughs> oh, that's just evil. <laughs> Time to to change that. Yes, I want to buy players, of course. Then again, I know there's stuff you can do, but I don't know. I mean, this is my first playthrough, so... Okay, Lyman, Blitzer, Runner, Assassin, Witch Elf. I don't know what any of these does. Lyman, Blitzer! Play with the blah 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 blah. Okay, they have block. The dump off. The skill allows the player to make a quick pass when an opponent declares that it will throw a block at him. Oh, the player that could read. Oh, oh, that's that's actually pretty nice. Runner makes sense. Assassin may use this skill when an opposing player moves out of the attack and so for any reason. The opponent player rolls two d six, adding their own movement allowance and subtracting the shadowing players. If if the score is seven or less, two d six. That's exactly the. That's exactly the... Uh, ah, damn it. Yeah, you know what I want to say. It's it's the half of 2d6. Ah, uh, blah. The player with shadowing... Oh, I see. May move in the like it. Stab. You stab people. The player may attack an opponent with a stabbing attack instead of throwing a block at them. An unmodified armor roll determines the effect of the stabbing attack. If the score beats the victim's armor value, then they have been wounded and an injury roll is made. If not, uh, then the stabbing attack has no effects. Casualties caused by a stabbing attack do not earn SPPs. I think that means a special player value? Points, rather? Something like that. Okay, we have one million, one million dollars. <laughs> ah, lineman, the jeep. I want the witch. I want the witch. The player with the skills is slavering, slavering, psychopath. That sounds like me. Who attacks his opponents in an uncontrollable rage? If a pushed or defender stumbles result was chosen, the player must immediately throw a second block against the same opponent. So long as they are both still standing in a season, they must always follow up. A player with the frenzy skill can never learn or gain the never learn or great or gain the grab skill, okay. So they probably Ah, I see. Dodge? Add up while slipping away from opponents and then out to the the reroll. To the six, blah, blah, blah. You can read for yourself, I'm not good at reading loud. <laughs> oh, 
Oh. Dodge retreat, defend the stomachs as pushbacks. Good. Keep that in mind, keep that in mind. Play what is game. If the player declares that any actions other than a block action, he may stand out for free without paying the three squares of movement. Huh. Okay, um, this, this uh, we will fail horribly, I guess. Anyway, let's buy a witch elf. Should we buy, buy two? We can get two of them. I think we need 12 players. I don't know much about this game and it's completely blind, of course, but uh, I've seen some stuff I see uh, of, of very access videos, so I know a, a tiny bit of stuff. <laughs> I didn't study uh, the rule book or anything like that. We're not st that we are ve we are very agile. Our armor value—I don't know if if that's good or not. We are we are whoa, we are pretty fast, I think. Agility four is good. Flying assassin, a runner, a blitzer. It's uh, by four linemen. Hey, it's by two witch elves, eh? Ah, no, it was by two assassins. Okay, I think that's that. That will be, that will be it. And we have seventy grand. Whatever this will be, will bring us. Cheerleaders, yeah, one cheerleaders. Cheerleaders like to influence kickoff events. All oh, right, all right, all right, all right. Rerolls, ha. Ah. But how much is a reroll? Oh, I. Oh. Well, no, 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 no. Whatever this is. Okay, one cheerleader. Okay, I could buy two cheerleaders and a reroll. How much does an apothecary cost? That's <sighs> reroll injury. Let's buy a, an apothecary because I'll probably play, play way too offensive. Uh, offensive. <laughs> oh. Aggressive, rather, and, and get injured. Accept. And two cheerleaders. Please. Team value 1000, okay. Assistant cautious fan fan. Damn it. Damn it. I, I probably should have done something here. Ah. Oh well. Let, let, let's. This play our team. This is our, our witch. This is our, our assassins, I guess. These are our linemen. This and these two guys will probably be our. Will they be our runners? I guess they are the run. No, these two will be the runners, and these are the blitzers. Okay, let me just read this. Okay. I need more. Okay. Next time we'll buy a bit of fan factor. Um. Yeah. Team roaster. Celerian. Nice name. Hmm. Okay. I think I will split this up into two videos so you can uh, dodge <laughs> all this, all the the uninteresting me getting used to the rules and buying stuff things. Prepare match. Uh, I don't know if this will start the game, but I, I guess. So yeah, until until to the next video. We have to pick a sponsor. <laughs> Ah. Mike Murphy, Marty, Bugmans, Goblin Gambling, Chaos Gift Show. No, I want King's Fit. <laughs> Skaven Cheese. Let's go with Skaven. No, let's go with. with um, yeah, why not? Mike Marty's. 
Well, let's see. Will there be any different difference? No. Let's go with Chaos Gift Shop. No. Green Tooth or Equipment. No. Skinks Fitness Club. Skinks. Uh, yeah, whatever. Um, percent of the victory for cost for coming. Yeah, okay, a fan factor of 10, that should this that should be doable, I think. I don't I have no idea what I'm doing here. Rankings, oh. Um I, I, man, I don't know. <laughs> I don't even know. Uh sign contracts? Yeah, I mean we have to anyway. I hope I didn't screw it all screw me over completely here. Did we get money? We didn't get money. Why? See sponsors contract. Sure, charge of an additional sum of. So if we get this, we get hundred something like. I, I, I don't know. Okay. So this will pro matches, 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 matches. Match the one, match the two. Uh, the Tlangsla javelins. Or Wolfenburg diggers. <laughs> what are these? Oh, Amazons. Javelins. Makes sense. Makes sense. Okay. Uh yeah. Let, let, let's just let's just play. I don't, I don't get it. I don't get it, viewer. Okay, prepare match. Whoosh. Shall we play Okay, against Norse or against Amazons? I Let's play against the Amazons. Prepare a match, so I guess this will start the game. So, let's do it! Let the slaughter commence! Oh, still not, yeah. <laughs> this is a lot of preparation, but we get three, 300 grands in petty cash. So sweet, so we can, so we can get more stuff. Training, we can train people, star players and mercenaries. Um, fair play, foul play. Oh god, this is this is a lot of stuff. I know that Bloodweiser babes are good for something. <laughs> a lovely lady to serve players before you go out of the each drive. Oh. Mouse one to recover. Yes, please give me a Bloodweiser babe. Foul play. Cheering fans. Bringing loads of cheering fans. Wizard. College of Magic frown upon the use of unlicensed wizard during a match, but that doesn't seem to stop some overly enthusiastic supporters playing the special talents at crucial moments to help the team. Once per game, the wizard is allowed to cast either a fireball spell or a lightning bolt spell. This may only cast the spe cast spells in the start of the turn before any player performs an action or immediately after the. How much will that cost? Uh, once per game. No. No. Child. Yeah. Let's buy two of those. Let's buy. Use scrolls more often. I don't know. What, what are scrolls? Wandering and path of A team of two to nine hundred in a match. Often these are one of the ones that are Only one of them may be used to reroute each casualty. Let's get one. Hundred grand. Whatever. Foul play. Bribe a player. Bribing a player can reduce his movement amount by one point. C. Bodyguard. Against bribery, okay. Ha! There's a lot to this game, I like it. 100 grand, uh, that was to attempt to ignore account. Let's get a bribe, I guess. No extra training. Uh, bad habits. You hire an incumbent and assistance coach for 100 grand. Team. Don't lose. Loses one team, reroll per half. Let's do it! So we have. No, I. I said. 
with 10 grounds, halfling master chef. 100 grand, whoa, 100, everything's so, so expensive. Um, can we get this anything for, for, uh, for 10 grand? I don't even... I don't even know, man. <laughs> I don't even know. Yeah, <sighs> Excuse me, I had to cough. Blood was a bit riding fence. Let's get... Okay, let's get rid of... of so we're 30. And let's see, I think potions maybe... maybe... <sighs> we could get 50. Okay, let's let's ha not have any riding fans. So we have 50 grand. Let's get something for 50 grand. There, mu there must be something for 50 grand. Um, the wizard was 100, the cheerings were 20. Foul play. Bribe is 100. Um, okay, bribe player. Um. Uh, um. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, this is... no, no, this is not. Extra training, bad habits, what's that, 50? What's, what's that, 50? <laughs> um, how much do they cost? So let's get another Bloodweiser, babe. Okay! Okay! <laughs> Inducement results. Not ranked yet. Not ranked yet. That was very good. Two kegs of extra special. special. Bloodweiser Magic Ale. I've hired one wandering apothecary. Agame Agamede Molpadia. The player has a one. Of, uh, so. Did, did, did they manage to get one point of agility plus? Reduced. Rerolls. Okay, start the match. So, in, until the next video, viewer, finally. 